Hi friends, welcome to testing tutorials point. This is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about our data picker in Cypress. How we can able to use for our data picker in Cypress. Okay. What is exactly data picker is just you can able to see here. This is a one uh, kind of application in this application and there is a data picker for this particular one. If I remove this one, if I click separately, you can see this is one type of text box. If you click the uh, your uh, calendar will be visible. We need to choose any kind of date and we can able to uh, provide. Even we can able to uh, choose based upon our months also. Okay, this kind of things how we can able to automate. This is one kind of uh, sample website. Okay, and in case in your case you are not able to handle this kind of uh, approaches and you are facing some issue. Just let me know that which URL, what situation you are facing the issue. Based upon that, I can able to do it for some automation. One particular video and I'll post in my YouTube channel. Okay. You can see and check that. Okay. Now we'll see here. But before going to do coding, you can see this is an reload. Means it is a frame location. It is the view frame source also it is presented. Means we are under this particular text box is presented under frame, right? How we can able to handle frames by using Cypress means I already added for my own video for that. Okay, frames handling. Please go through that video and you can able to learn of frames handling. Okay. Once we load, then you can able to get it. Okay. And here is the basically we need to import. This frames is basically uh, required to add the plugins that also I showed in that particular video. Please go through that. You can able to see how to install your frames into Cypress and how you can able to use it. Everything it will be presented there. Okay. And I'm going to create for my date picker test case and then we to make it for full function creation then see why dot visit okay in this inside that we are going to take this particular url okay then we need to first we need to load for our uh, iframe how we can able to load our iframe is see why dot frame loader frame loader and here we can able to load for our frame first then only we can able to do some operation inside the frames okay how we can able to means if you inspect this particular one anything in the inside of the space and if you go top there is a frame iframe right if you once you mouse over entire thing is loaded okay if this is our class this is a name we need to choose it okay and uh, class we need to indicate for dot and we need to specify the name of that Okay, once we're done for this particular load condition and we need to use it to uh, first we need to here to find and enter a value for this basically we have, whenever we want to click something means we can able to use a cy dot get and we can able to provide that particular element to select class or id which is the one attribute or something we are going to mention but in our case now because we it is presented inside of the frame Due to that, we need to use it for dot iframe. iframe is a method because we are loaded the frame, then we need to do for iframe loading purpose. Okay. Once we load, you can inspect this particular element. This is the ID presented. We can able to take for ID. And you can able to after find you need to use for find keyword. Find keyword is basically inside the frame whether we are searching element is presented or not this find element what will happen whenever you done inside the frame it will go this particular place and there is any uh, value is presented basically there is any id value is presented by using this data picker or not if it is presented then it will go that particular file place then once we can present it we can able to type our format This is our format. We need to choose it and I can able to choose for 1st January. I'll specify specifying here. 
and after that I'm going to open it for NPX. So I press open. Okay, we can able to load our Cypress and we can able to choose for our browser. Data picker and you can able to see now it will enter and we can able to see that uh, information or the January. You can see now. First eighth two thousand twenty three, and this site will show for January. Okay, this is a case we can able to use for our data picker. Okay, this is a simple format of data picker using for our Cypress. In your case, if there is any difficulty you are facing, please let me know that which URL and which situation, and I can uh, try to help you. But not maybe if I'm busy, I'm, I will not be I will not give you a reply immediately. But I'll try to give you some time. One or two days at least I can able to give you some result for you. Okay, that's all about this video. Please like my video, please subscribe my YouTube channel and don't forget to share your friends and colleagues. Thank you.